Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Alina Liebeva. Now I want to show you my presentation, which is called Russian Foreign Policy under Vladimir Putin, Successes and Failures. It is not the time to sum up the final results of Putin's rule. Nevertheless, it will be useful to think what has been done in foreign policy in 20 years. My talk is divided into seven parts. I will start with the goal of my presentation. After that, I will talk about successes, failures, and future development in Russian foreign policy. And further, I will finish with a summary, conclusion and references. Now, we turn to the introduction. So, I'd like to say that Russia is the largest country in the world. It has a lot of power. And today, I want to show you achievements and failures in Russian foreign policy. Let's start with the successes. Vladimir Putin could say the unity of Russia and its great power status, development of the army and modernization of nuclear potential allows Russia to maintain its status as the second largest military power in the world after the USA. Under Putin, Russia has also restored its status as energy power country. Gas supplies are growing. The northern and Turkish streams are built in the European Union. One more achievement in Russian foreign policy is that Crimea became a part of Russia. Crimea has a profitable geopolitical possession, so it was a great success for Russia to retrieve this region. Now, about failures. Russia has been under severe United States and European Union sanctions for six years. Sanctions against Russia have a great impact on the Russian economy. Russia's main input partners are the European Union countries that have applied sanctions against Russia. The development of the Ukrainian crisis puts Russia in a very difficult position. It is forced to react to current events which leads to conflict with the new Kiev government and the West behind it. Russia's attempts to stabilize the situation were not successful. At the moment, Russia faces the task of withstanding pressure from the United States and its partners. At the same time, Russia is trying to reduce political isolation and adapt its economy to sanctions and low oil prices. Russia's main foreign policy priorities are blocking NATO inspection. Moscow has own strategy. It is to create such conditions that its opponents are forced to recognize Russia's interests and its own as a great power. To sum up, I would like to mark the main points. I informed you about successes, failures and prospects in foreign policy under Vladimir Putin. In conclusion, I'd like to say 
that Russia is quite successful in foreign policy, but at the same time, it has own mistakes in this sphere. Here you can see the references I used during creation this, creating this presentation. Thank you for your attention.